Greensboro, Lee, Manatee, Pinellas, and Sarasota, they can now register for assistance and begin their recovery process. You can register by visiting disasterassistance.gov through our FEMA app or by calling 1-800-621-FEMA, 1-800-621-3362. And now that the sun is up and we are continuing to do our assessments, we will add more counties for individual assistance. The next few days, they're going to be difficult. We have some very complex problems to solve. But like I said, we have the right teams in place who are ready to help those who need us most. And regardless of how bad it is, I commit to everyone here today that FEMA and our partners across the federal, state, and local levels remain ready and prepared to help these communities in their greatest time of need. Thank you. Let me add one more thing. We didn't mention the, the uh, Red Cross. The Red Cross is there. They're always there. They stepped up and they continue to step up. So I want to thank them as well. Thank you. President, how would you describe your relationship and your conversation with Governor DeSantis? It's totally irrelevant, but I'll answer it, okay? In fact, very fine. He complimented me. He thanked me for the immediate response we had. He told me how much he appreciated it, said he was extremely happy with what was going on. This is not about whether or anything having to do with our disagreements politically. This is about saving people's lives, homes, and businesses. That's what this is about. And so I've been, I've talked to him four or five times already. And it's not a matter of my disagreements with them on other items. Do you hold Russia responsible for the rupture of the Nord Stream pipeline? Let's stick with this, okay? Well, this, is important, this is an important international issue. There's we a have, lot of important international issues, but we're we have, here to talk have, about America. Well, we have okay, have thank you. Thank you. Mr. President.